average on a 3 1 win. What was your thoughts on the performance from the boys out there? I thought, I thought first half we were absolutely outstanding. I thought second half we were good. Um, I thought it was a first class performance. I really did. I thought boys played really well. Uh, I was really disappointed in midweek the way we played. We haven't played like that all season and we had a blip. We rebounded from that against a side that's had a great win last week uh, at Leighton Orient. Um, and we were a good side. And I just thought we were outstanding today. Do you feel you just sort of counteracted everything that they had? I think so, but I thought some of our football, some of the, our passing and movement, I thought was, was absolute, absolute first class. I really did. I thought that ball retention, uh, I thought movement, um, pace of our game, I thought was very, very good. Um, and it's, it's what I expect from us. I'm not being funny now, it's what I expect. Uh, we moved the ball, terrific. Um, I think they've scored, scored when they scored the goal, I thought that was about their only chance of scoring. They had a good chance not long after that, but I thought we had good opportunities as well to score. And I just thought you know, it was a good day for, for us, if I'm being honest. Yeah, Mark wasn't severely tested really, was he? No, he wasn't at all. And uh, as I said, I just thought the movement, front two were very, very good, very sharp. Uh, Cheeky's just come in, we need to get him fitter, but very sharp, uh, very quick. We've got a lot of pace up front, so... And even when we brought Mason on, you know, he'd done very well, done the young lad. So, but all in all, it was a good day for us. I was really pleased. Mm. Getting the first goal always, always helped. You sort of able to build course, on that. Of course. Um, I think that once we got in front, we looked like we we looked like we had goals in us. Uh, went two up. The third one and a half time pr probably killed the game. Um, and uh, could we have done a bit better with one or two chances second half, possibly, but. You know, it's hard to keep that intensity. We had great intensity in the first half. It's hard to keep that up. But we kept great ball retention, so I was delighted with that. Mm. Must have been pleased with the response sort of following sort of the, the two Yeah, but I, I, would, I would expect that, if I'm being honest. Um, I think the players were disappointed. Um, as I said, no one saw that. But I actually thought that the game on Tuesday, I didn't think it was a very good game. I don't think we played well, and I don't think Sutton played well. I don't think either team played particularly well. And I think that on the day... Uh, we could have won it, they could have won it, they did win it, uh, we could have won it, it could have been a draw, it could have any result you like, because no team actually deserved, I don't think either team deserved to win it, we didn't deserve to win, I don't know if we deserved to lose, but we didn't deserve to win, I don't think they deserved to win, so, you know, fair play to them, they got the, the, the goal that, that, that made the difference, and, and, you know, well done them, but I look at what we can produce, and we never got anywhere near that. Produced today though, in terms of, of Morgan as well, Morgan yeah. was... Perfect throughout the game, and uh, Corey as well again. No, absolutely. We, we've we've like... got lots of pace and we've got lots of goals in our team. And when we have a night like we had on, on Tuesday, I, I can't see where that comes from because we're much better than that. We haven't had it all season. That's all season, we haven't had too much of the season, but we haven't had it so far this season. And uh, it was disappointing, but listen, I've been in the game long enough to know that sometimes teams don't play well, but we've responded how we would expect today. I suppose you've got to expect sort of spells okay. like that maybe throughout the course of a season. Um, you know what, I don't. Mm. I don't. No, I don't. I think that we have enough good players here to be able to cater for someone that's off form. I do think we've got enough players to, to do that. Okay. Looking ahead to, to next week now, obviously trip to Solihull. What are you yeah, well, about? you know, home and away, we, we, we don't change how we play. We play the same way. We, we want to keep the ball moving. We want to use our pace that we've got in the team, and I think if we do that, whoever we play has to play well to beat us. If we don't play well, anything can happen, but as long as we play well, we know the other team has got to play well to beat us. And in terms of sort of overall, sort of looking at the bigger picture, what is your, in terms of, do you feel that you're on schedule for, for well, where you, you want know, to be? Well, you know, I always go, it takes eight, nine, ten games to get your season underway. Some teams start slow, some start quick. We've started how I would like to have started. Um, I've started much slower than this before and, and won the league. I've started quicker than this and not won the league. We've started well and um, I, I think we've been very fortunate that we've put in some good performances and got enough points to keep us in and around that top group. So that's, that's as much as I can hope for. Yeah. Thank Cheers. you very much. Thank you, John.